Before the Big Ten Tournament, we came off of a really good series um, from Iowa. We swept the series 3-0, and um, we went into the Big Ten Tournament with great momentum. We were on a pretty high winning streak, and um, we went into the tournament with a lot of confidence. I think we did a really good job uh, coming in against Illinois, beating them, because Illinois is a really, really tough team as well. The game was 2-0, it was a close game. Uh, I didn't necessarily have my stuff, all my stuff working that day, but I knew that I had my defense behind me. Uh, they made some unreal plays. Kayla Winter had an unreal dive in left field. A running and diving catch from Kayla Winter in left. Laying out for the second out of the inning, a BTN standout play. Kayla Winter stretching out, good concentration to get the ball in her glove and then lets her body just extend fully. A outstanding effort play in the outfield by Winter. I just knew that my defense was behind me and uh, I think that's why I pulled through with the middle. Semi-final against Northwestern was a tough one. Um, Northwestern is always a good team. They're always competitive. They battled, and um, really the game was really close until the rain did. Paige Polkovich going yard. That was up and over the scoreboard. You talk about a no doubter. That was it. Well, we saw Sarah. You're absolutely right. Polkovich topped that one over the scoreboard. Just an aggressive swing. Hit a hard foul ball to pitch before that. But you can see, gets a little up angle on her bat and pitch down the middle, and that's all it took. Big hit for Minnesota, and a big celebration. <laughs> they get creative with those. The sixth home run of the year for Popovich. Drills it right at second base. The double play is made by Minnesota. Heads up look by Danielle Parlay. I like to say it was kind of a blessing in disguise to have the rain delay because we came out a different team. We came out guns blazing after the after the rain delay. Uh, we came out uh, playing loose. We were kind of relaxing a little bit in the locker room, singing some songs, uh, bonding, I guess you could say. So. Yeah, it was definitely a good thing to have that rain delay. Sydney Fabian uh, got a hit. I think it was the first pitch, and all of us were so pumped. And then Sam Mackin, she comes and hits a home run, like a deep home run down the right field line, and we knew from that moment there was no way we were losing. There was no way we were losing that game right after that home run. So I think that Sam did a really good job of giving us that extra lead and leads give you confidence. So I think. It helped a lot.
championship game. Uh, we were playing Michigan for the first time this season and we were so ready. We knew that it was going to be hard, but we knew that it wasn't impossible. And we believed fully that we could win that game. And I think having that confidence and the belief that we can do it really helped us push through in the end and win. I was on second base and Nell was up to bat. She ended up hitting one to the shortstop and I beat the ball. I was in front of it so I didn't see it kick away. And I heard uh, the third baseman from Michigan yelling 3-3-3 so I thought there was going to be a play. I was like, I'm not going to get out. So I slid into third and Coach Alster was right there yelling, get up, go. And uh, that's exactly what I did. So I was sprinting home. I glanced at the outfield and saw that uh, the center fielder had the ball and got a little nervous, but then I saw the catcher take a step to the outside, so I took one to the inside and, and went for it, and it worked out. The weird hop to short. They are going to send the run home. Minnesota does it again. A walk-off win against the Wolverines. Minnesota, your 2016 Big Ten Tournament champs in the bottom of the tent. And they just keep coming at you and coming at you. What a way to win the championship for Minnesota. We went past the midnight hour to get to this point. senior class this year was really special and emotional and something I'll never forget and a great way to end the Big Ten career for.